Hey, what is going on guys? Ready Games back with another video. And in today's video, we are playing Black Ops 3 on the PS4. So, if you don't know, on the 2nd of February, which is tomorrow by the time this video comes out, that there is going to be the new DLC for Black Ops 3 called Awakening. That's going to be... Oh my... If you haven't seen any of the maps yet, of the trailer maps for the Awakening DLC, you should go watch it now. Because it's so amazingly well done. So, first map I want to talk about is the zombies map called Der Eisendraha. That's basically like a castle in the snow where there's... I see the rocket in the gameplay. And two specialists, the sparrow and the uh, gravity spikes. So that's good too. Um, also, I have seen uh, that you play as the World at War uh, zombies characters now. So you don't play as the Shadows of Evil. And if you... If, if you haven't seen the Dare Eyes of Draha trailer yet, you wouldn't want to go back to the watch. Like, if you thought the Shadows of Evil trailer was good, trust me, go watch Dare Eyes of Draha, because that's even better, like 10 times better than uh, Shadows of Evil. So, second map is Skyjacked. That's a remake of Hijack for Black Ops 2. And uh, they did a pretty well job with it. It's in the sky, so, as you could tell. And um, there's kind of like a middle bit, in, like in Hijacked on Black Ops 2, there was like a middle bit in the boat. So there's kind of like a middle part in the um, skyjacked as well, like that uh, flying airship, I think it is. Uh, Rising, I think, when I, I haven't seen the trailer for that yet, but I think it looks a kind of like drone from Black Ops 2, but just less dull. Um, sec uh, third TLC uh, map is Splash. Splash looks really good, like that's probably be... Uh, it's going to be the most funnest map out of all of them because it is kind of it kind of reminds me of um the map where in black ops 2 they had the skater park kind of reminds me of that it looks so good like there's so many turns and twists and tunnels and all that stuff so and then the final map is gauntlet which is the three maps in one that is basically a snow snow kind of a map and then a jungle kind of a map and a kind of like a place where there's like a lot of facilities and that's like a lot like three um three different types of maps in one like that's insane so yeah treyarch have done a really good job with this dlc awakening so hopefully it's good and if you're thinking of buying the season pass or the other dlc maps um separately you should because it's definitely worth it if you're a call of duty player for a long time or you just like playing the game um regularly or you like making content on it so yeah hopefully i can get that gameplay out for you guys as fast as possible and i'll see you guys next time peace